Okay, everybody, this is five things that every gig worker hates the most. I look to do the job. Exclamation point. Gary, that's his name, but I won't show you the address. Savage, bro. Savage. Dreaded stairs. Everybody loves it. Every gig worker's worst nightmare is going up three flights of stairs to an apartment. Every gig worker's nightmare is right in front of me. Three flights of this crap without any elevators. This is so much fun. I wish every place had elevators to tell you the truth because it would be a lot easier. And guess what also? You don't know what side it could be on. 215 could be on this side or it could be on the other side down there which is behind the tree. So I could be going up three flights of stairs for no reason and then go up another three flights of stairs. This is why I hate stairs. For every gig worker that has to deal with this, I'm sorry. Peacock! 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 Their last name is Peacock. Please try your call again. What the fuck do you mean? What do you mean I have to dial area code? What the fuck are you talking about? Area code. Peacock! Peacock! Ah, come on, peacocks. What, you put the wrong number in your damn thing? Is that what you did? The stupid smucks? You know, you're about to get, like, uh, beat up the side of your head. What the fuck? I didn't press anything. Come on, can, I, can somebody come in here so I can go behind you? So one day I was in a restaurant. I was picking up a DoorDash order, and the order was not ready, and the staff said that it would only be a few minutes. Well, a few minutes turned into a few more minutes, and then those minutes turned into more minutes, and eventually it got to a point where I was waiting for an absurd amount of time for a DoorDash order. So eventually I got fed up, and I asked the restaurant, hey, you know, when is this order coming? It's already 10 minutes past my pickup time. I've been waiting, you know, it's not busy in the store. What's going on? So I went outside of the restaurant and it finally clicked in my head. Is this order even worth the time I'm spending on it? So I'm sure we've all been there. We've all been to restaurants that tell us it's only going to be a few minutes or we're just bagging it up. And it turns out that's couldn't be farther from the truth. They probably haven't even started the order and they're just telling you a BS lie to get you not to leave. So the way I do it is when I go to a restaurant and the order is not ready, I try to give them at least five to 10 minutes, depending on how many other people are in the restaurant. Order, Cause it's the same restaurant. So we're gonna get this off. Oh, that sounded wrong. We're gonna drop this off as soon as we can and then go home. gone home immediately but I kept checking the tire pressure making sure we're good the tire was just losing air it wasn't flat so we're gonna make it home if you guys made this video hope you guys enjoyed like and subscribe to see more content like this see you guys later